In this video I'm going to show you how I use the oven to um, restore my video card. I have an uh, Dell XPS M1710 and uh, the graphics card went on it. So basically I popped it out, I removed the heat sinks and uh, cleaned off all the thermal paste. Now I was pretty disappointed when I saw the thermal paste that Dell uses. Um, the only thing I can compare it to is like toffee or peanut brittle. It was very hard and crusty and I used a plastic scraper to scrape it off. When I was scraping it off it came off in chunks. So that's pretty bad. Uh, shame on you Dell. Um, yeah, basically you heat, preheat your oven to 200 degrees Celsius and put it on a cookie tray. I put little tin foil balls underneath it to support it and I left it in there for 10 minutes. After that I took it out and cooled it down for around 15 minutes. I reapplied thermal paste and put it all back together and I was shocked to see that it actually works again. So um, this is my little tutorial on how to do it and uh, if you have a removable graphics card in your laptop or maybe even um, you know one out of your tower that's failed uh, this should work and uh, I hope you enjoy. Okay, so first it does the DVD-ROM. It'll uh, it'll check that it's it's working, I guess. It runs through a little hard drive test, and here we go. I guess these are the three quick beeps. It's probably telling you, I'm dead, I'm dead. Put me out of my misery. Here we go. Video test. And it'll pretty much just do an endless loop of uh, the series of beeps, and that's it. So they're going to replace the motherboard and the screen once it's sent back. So that's the. <laughs> those are my error codes on the M1710. This is the teardown of the M1710. As you can see, I've taken it all apart. I wasn't uh, do I wasn't gonna do a little step by step on how to take it apart because I can't really hold a camera and take all the screws out. But she's all stripped open now. The uh, heat sinks were pretty jammed with dust, and uh, it seemed like the thermal paste had turned into some kind of, I don't know, hardened taffy, like it, it wasn't even paste anymore, it was just a hard crap. So I have the uh, graphics card and uh, it's downstairs right now. I'm just waiting for the oven, it's preheating to 200 degrees and I'm going to try baking the graphics card. Now this is being sent back to Dell to get fixed anyways, so if I could get it going, you know that'd be cool if not it's gonna go back and and whatever so here's hoping okay I'm downstairs now we have an open hope this works now put it in the middle of rack. Now 
that just looks weird. I've never put anything like this in the oven. Okay, it's been 10 minutes. Okay, the card is now cool, and I'm going to go through the process of uh, hooking up the heat sinks and putting it all back together. Wow, unbelievable. I've got sign of life. So here it is, hooked up and running. Once you're through the gate. And this is where its home usually is. When I turned it on, it was a blue screen and it was it was toast. But now it's all good and I can't believe it worked.